Hello everyone, welcome in my channel ASP.NET MVC. Today I am going to show you online law system, how to design online law system in ASP.NET Core. So uh, before going to uh, the details of uh, online law system, actually uh, I am going to uh, the modules of the law system. So first of all, we'll, uh, we will design uh, uh, the authentication process actually so in which we have two roles in the law system the first one is admin through which we can uh, add it update and delete or you can say the uh, card operations will performed and uh, the second one thing is the user module uh, that all uh, the viewers uh, who visits the websites and uh, who wants to uh, mm, the inquiry of the law system and uh, particulars uh, the things in the law system okay according to the penal courts okay uh, so these are the uh, db initializer class uh, to initiate uh, the role in the uh, asp.net core so this is the basic thing uh, must know about uh, um, in asp.net core how to create a role in asp.net identity servers so just copied it and paste into your uh, project in the db initializer class so first of all create a new class db initializer and replace that class from this uh, course uh, where we have uh, application db context user manager with the application user class because actually application user classes does not exist in the in a new newly created project okay so uh, just use control dot to resolve the issues or you can so you can say that resolve the um, uh, usings actually or you can say a name spaces also so here we have application db context and uh, application user class does not exist and in which project we have only two roles uh, the first one is a user and the sorry first one is the admin and second one is the user and also you can change the email admin at the rate of online law.com and the password is the same admin one two three one two three this is uh, okay and here we have user manager to find my email email result equals to null application user new application user now design application user class in the model folder so add a new class also and the application user class where you can register uh, the new user actually and the first admin will uh, added uh, already in the db initializer class so you can uh, these things you can design it so identity user and uh, so resolve this application user class so thank you very much guys for watching this video and keep watching all of the remaining videos of online law system if you want to learn many more things please subscribe my channel thank you very much